if you are reading lesson one on primary, a new world. The memory verse is Genesis 1 verse 1. Genesis 1 verse 1. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. In, In the, the beginning, beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. The method of this story is God is, is love, is written upon all he made. God is love, is written upon all he made. Have you ever been in a very dark place, no light anywhere? That's just what it was like when God began to create our world. God looked at the dark, watery face. It was time to put this plan for us into motion. Then God said, let there be light. And suddenly there was a bright light. God separated the light from the darkness. Excuse me. He called the light day and the darkness night. This was the first day of creation. God lo looked around. Water covered everything. He spoke and the water divided forming the sky. This was the second day of creation. God looked at the watery world. He said, let the sky water, let the sky, the, the, the water under the sky be separated and let dry land appear. As he spoke, it happened. God called the water seas and the dry ground land. God, God looked at the land and seas and saw that it was good. Then God said, let the land produce vegetation, seed, seed bearing plants and trees on the land that bear fruit with, this, with seed in it according to the very of the various kinds and it was so god looked at the plants and trees and saw that it was good this was the third day of creation god looked up up in the sky let there be light in the heavens to separate the day and night and he said there there they will the the light will the, the light the the they will light the, they will light the earth and mark seasons days and years god made two great lights the sun was brighter to the sun was brighter light to shine during the day the moon was the weaker light to shine at night god god made two great great God also. God, God also made the stars. God looked at the sun, moon, and the stars and saw that it was good. This was the first day of creation. God, God said, let, let the seas and rivers be filled with living creatures. Let the birds fill the air with their songs. God looked at all the creatures that, that live in the water. He watched the birds that the, he was the birds. That's good. He said. He said, God bless them and God bless them and said, be fruitful and increase a number, fill the seas, the the rivers and the sky. This was the fifth day of creation. God said, let the land produce living creatures, livestock, li livestock creatures that move along the ground and wild animals. God looked at them and saw that they were good. Then God said, let us make people in our image. They will rule over the fish, the sea, and the birds, the, the, the birds, the livestock, the animals that creep on the ground, and all other living things. God created men and women. Next next week lesson will give the the details how it happened. And bless them saying, Be fruitful and increase a number. Fill the, the earth and rule over it. Give you all I the, give you. I give you all the seed bearing plants and fruit of the trees for food. I give every creature creature, every green plant for food. God looked at everything that he that he had made, and and it was very good. This was the sixth day creation. God, 
God made the world in six days. When He finished making it, making it beautiful, He gave Adam and Eve he gave it to to Adam and Eve to care for. God still loves us. God still gives us wonderful gifts today because He loves us. When we see see that the wonderful things in nature. Let's remember God's love shown by the things he had made. Amen. Amen.